Well, it's a first of its kind spinal surgery, a groundbreaking breaking procedure with robots playing a key role. That's right, and only five, Fox 5 takes you inside the operating room to show you how it's done. Lisette Nunez has more in tonight's big idea. I wasn't really able to walk at all. Amir Jabini says he has a new lease on life. That's thanks to a groundbreaking spinal surgery performed by doctors utilizing two robots. Yeah, you heard that right, two robots. According to Mount Sinai Hospital, Amir is one of the first to go through with a 360 degree spinal fusion. I'm uh, very excited. I'm willing to do it and be the first one, maybe help the others that they can see this technology is available. This was Amir right before surgery. For several months, he had been dealing with severe lower back pain. The pain took a toll on him, making it difficult to walk at times. The pain is not bearable. That's the problem. He tried physical therapy, pain meds, but nothing worked. So doctors at Mount Sinai suggested an innovative surgery for his condition. This patient had spondylosis, spondylolysis, spondylolisthesis, which means they had arthritic changes to the disc and narrowing of the disc between the vertebrae, which is a narrowing of the cushion between the two vertebrae. In addition to that, he had a fracture on both sides, a degenerative fracture and a part of the bone called the pars. This is video taken in December from inside the surgery room as the two robots under doctor supervision began prepping for the surgery. So now we're using a robot to plan our incisions and plan our screws before we actually get going. For the first part of the surgery, the Da Vinci robot, which allowed us to get access through the abdomen to get to the spine, where we were able to replace a disc with a cage that increased the height of the disc. We flipped the patient and we used a different robot uh, called the globus robot that allowed us to put percutaneous screws through the skin into the bone with extremely high accuracy and precision. Dr. Steinberger says this innovative surgery is meant to be more minimally invasive than a traditional spinal surgery, but still deliver the same results. But we're able to do it through these small ports, keeping and preserving all the muscles and ligaments intact in doing so. Two months post-surgery and with his wife by his side helping him with recovery, Amir says he's never felt better. How do you feel? What has recovery been? Like. The recovery has been great. I don't have the pain. I can walk any distance. This innovative surgery has been a highlight in Dr. Steinberger's medical career, and he hopes that this can help more patients. This is a really big step into the future. And Amir tells me he is just happy to be doing the things he loves once again, such as going out to dinner with his friends and family. He's also just really grateful for the doctors here at Mount Sinai and recommends anyone experiencing back pain to seek medical attention as soon as possible. On the Upper East Side, Lisette Nunez, Fox 5 News.